Hey guys, welcome back to my channel if you're old and welcome to my channel if you're new. Tidying is just so cathartic and I don't know if this is me almost being an adult but um, yeah, tidying is just so cathartic, it just makes you feel so good that you've done something productive, um, you've done something for yourself as well. I mean this is my room, it's my environment so I'm going to make it the best environment physically possible. Um, my room was a mess, I'm, I'm filming this after I've already tidied my room. My room was a mess, like, you may not have been able to see it from the surface, but things like under my desk and in cupboards and boxes, a mess. Not anymore though, because we tidied that. Um, this is, I mean, I'm filming this on Boxing Day, the 26th of December, and it's like, you get new stuff at Christmas time and you're like, hmm, my room's a mess, where do I put it? Tidy up. Um, and I feel so much like, whew, I feel so much freer now, but anyway. Don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment down below, do all that great stuff. Let's get into the time lapse part um, and I'll have we talk with you all there. And then, yeah, we'll see each other on the other side. Okay, hello everyone from Voice Over Land. Um, I'm currently using a new mic, which my twin brother bought for me for Christmas. So, Lewis, if you're watching, thank you very much. I love it. And yeah, you're listening to the product now. So, yeah, Christmas Day has come and gone. I mean, obviously when you're watching this, it's going to be a lot later, so you don't want to hear about Christmas. Um, it's probably over a month ago when this is coming out, but I'm so happy. I had a great day, made the most of the situation. But now, on to cleaning. So my room is, I think it's two and a half years old now. I moved into this room and there was nothing in it, like absolutely nothing, and you know, started to bring some of my stuff in and kind of set up. And over the years, it's got messier and messier, and there's some stuff I've tidied up. Like I usually do a big, like a big, big proper clean before every school year, and also after every school year, but then in the summer, some stuff just kind of builds up, I suppose. But I usually do a massive clean for the year and I did do a big clean this year but it was more for school stuff and it was more getting everything ready to start this year of school and then there wasn't really a start of the year it was yeah it was a bit of a confusing situation but so today I decided that I really needed to just do a proper clean and not just of the school stuff of everything and I mean everything in my room has got tidied, has got resorted, reshuffled, cleaned, like it's intense. I found some stuff that I'd just kind of forgotten existed and I suppose it's one of the cool things about hiding a room because you do just find those things that you just completely forgot were there. Um, I'm, by the way, I'm using my new mic um, and my new phone stand. It's like a tripod except there's two legs bipod, I suppose. Um, and yeah, that's exciting as well, which is why I'm getting all these different shots and angles and stuff. But anyway, um, yeah, I found like loads of school timetables from years ago. I found loads of random stuff that were immediately thrown in the bin and loads of notebooks that were like started but never finished with really, really random stuff in it. Like I don't even know what it was that I was doing or why I put them there, but I just kind of did. Yeah, I, d I don't know what was going on with that. Um, and then whenever I started cleaning, as you're seeing now with all the dust, I started, like my allergies were like, nope, no, we're not having this. Um, so sneezing started and sneezing started and came in in full force. I was kind of dying at one point, but you know. Um, yeah, then we continued on with hiding like, a mess was up here. I found loads of cool stuff. I found like stickers, but not like empty blank stickers that I could use. Um, so I'm kind of excited to use those at some point in the future because I know they'll be necessary at some point. And yet yeah, so many random things. And I had this little like container thing that I had never actually probably used. Like there's just like three random things in it. So obviously that was sorted. Um, a lot of the work is going on behind the scenes and when I tell you that this took about two hours, three hours, like it did take the full time, which I mean I don't mind, I don't have anything else to do today, but like it took forever. You can see the mess that is currently on the floor, obviously I'm taking all the stuff out because yeah there's no need for it to be there and putting it in its proper perspective places. 
You can also see what I'm wearing. Um, this is my, I don't know what, what you call it, it's a massive, extremely cosy and furry jumper, which is more, you know, I'm not going out in it, it's for home, but it is so comfy and it's so cosy, it's unbelievable. And I'm wearing it now as I'm recording this and it's just so soft and uh, I love it. It was extremely warm though, so I did have to take it off um, after tidying up. But now you can see my bookcase, and now <laughs> my bookcase was a mess of so many stupid things. Like you can see, the bin is just filling up there with all the stuff that's going to be recycled. Like so many stupid things. Um, loads of new notebooks that I put in there, and then Lewis appeared. You can just see his foot there, lol. Um, I don't know what he was talking about, but yeah, he was there for a minute. Yeah, continued on tidying up. You can see just kind of the mess of what is there, and you can see me singing along to my songs while also kind of having an allergic reaction to all the dust. Yeah, my life. But I kind of reshuffled this entire thing, some of it on camera, a lot of it off camera, like a lot of it was off camera, because I had to take all the books out. They were all over my floor for quite a while. I then tested all the pens, sorted my candles. I have a pretty big candle collection. It was all sorted. Um, but yeah, it was intense, guys. But then after a solid three hours and a lot of recycling trips, I had pretty much then finished and I feel so good about it. And so we're on the other side. Um, yeah, I honestly do feel a bit um, like I'm going to sneeze because of dust and I'm allergic to dust. So, yeah, that's a bit of a problem with cleaning for me. But, but we'll ignore that. And I'll see what, see what you saw in those um, time lapses. It wasn't even half. It was not even half of the amount of tidying. Um, how long did I spend? Three hours? Um, three hours in total tidying and maybe, maybe recorded an hour of it. Maybe. Like... My room doesn't look different, but it feels different. It feels like new, as you can see. I have a floating um, holdier thing there. Um, my desk is still a bit of a mess, but I'll clean that up later. The desk doesn't take too long. But I've like got different places for stuff. I have now storing stuff in different places. Um, yeah, that took a lot of work. And I got rid of a lot of stuff I just I was kind of keeping on for no reason. Um, and found things that I hadn't found for a while. Didn't use them, just kind of found them and just left them there. Um, but yeah. A lot of stuff happened. I do feel like I'm going to sneeze because, um, yeah, dust. But I'm happy with the progress we made. And if you want to tidy up with me, you know, tidy with me video, um, catharsis, you know, yeah, join along in. But anyway, um, thank you all for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. Do all that great stuff. But thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.